The Great Depression started in the early 1930s from the stock market crash brought from the perceived carelessness of Herbert Hoover. The people were so doubtful in Hoover that they named their little shanty towns Hoovervilles. This great nation will endure as it has endured, we will revive and we will prosper. So first of all, let me assert my firm belief that the only thing we have to fear is fear itself. Nameless, unreasoning, and justified terror which paralyzes needed efforts to convert, retreat, and to advance. FDR's election helped bring a change to America and put hope into all the Americans affected by the Great Depression. In every dark hour of our nation's life, a leadership of frankness and vigor has met with that understanding and support of the people themselves, which is essential to victory. FDR's first inaugural address made a huge impact on what the American public thought about him as the president. I am convinced that you will again give support to leadership in these critical days. FDR also changed the daily lives of Americans by giving them hope and by addressing the movement. People from all over the nation tuned into their radios every week just to hear him speak about the nation's current events. Franklin also promised the public a new deal which he carried out in full. Franklin's new deal was a chain of companies that helped the general public with everything. Most of these companies were very small organizations, but he made hundreds of them, and they were also very effective. The deal helped millions of people into work, into homes, and off the streets. FDR's fireside chats were so effective to show the president's care that they are still used today.